Hello and welcome back to my tutorial. This time I'm going to teach you how to um, put links into your page, how to put line breaks, and text tags. You can see that I've edited the title a bit. Here I'm going to move that so you can see all of it. And then I can tell you that you can move everything and it won't change very anything um, unless you're writing in some sort of uh, in, in HTML it won't change anything. So I'm going to teach you here how to put in links. So first I'm going to go write in an anchor script with an href equals hmm, let's see we'll just go to Google so HTTP www.google.com and finish that with your quotation. Don't forget the quotations on there. Right there. Okay, and we're gonna finish that off and it's gonna say Google. We're gonna end this anchor script here. And let's see. We're gonna put a line break in, which is that this right here. And that'll go down a line. We're also gonna go down a line on here. And I'm going to write in hmm, some text tags. So I'm going to go P, which is paragraph. So it's going to say, hello. And I'm going to go end this. And on the next line, another P. And it's going to say world. And that. Okay, so we're going to test that out right now. I'm going to save that. Okay, so we're going to refresh it. And we get this. So we have our link to Google. I did click on it. It will go. Um, and you can see that with the paragraph, it separated the lines here. So it's like breaking it if you have two different paragraphs. Um, that's weird that it's not going to Google. But normally it would work. Okay. So we're going to go back here. Let's see what else we can do. We can go change an href here. We're going to go a name equals, hmm, what should we call it? We'll call it test. You can change that to whatever you want. Um, and we're going to close that and we're going to say this is a test and that anchor there. And up here, we're going to go a href equals test. I've never actually tried this before, so go to test. We're going to write that in there. Okay, so yeah, I've never tried this. Um, hopefully, it'll work. I'm going to put another break here. Okay, I'm going to save this save over to here okay now Google's loaded you can't really see it but it is um, let's see if I can move this yeah you can see Google here I'm sure so uh, let's try and align this again sorry about that okay there we go so I'm gonna go back here here's gonna be go to test and you can see here you can't completely see it. Let me move. I'm not going to move that over again. But it has that and if it was a bigger page, it would scroll down to this line here. And that line would go right up at the top where it says like where I'm pointing the cursor right now. And so that just makes it so you can go go to top and you can put the top line of code. You can add that anchor in. And um that's basically what you need for text codes here is all of this stuff. Mm, let's think if there's anything else. Oh, one more thing here is we're going to put this before just to see if it'll do anything. I'm going to go H1, which is header 1. That's just a uh, it's just a predefined header and you can edit those with uh CSS, which I'll get to in another tutorial. And in here we'll go hello world end h1 I'm gonna go h2 hello 
world h2 oops that's h1 h2 h3 and so on h3 okay h4 and h4 go to well, we'll just leave it at that I'm gonna save this here Save. Okay, going back over to this. You can see it's gotten a bit bigger now. It's um so this is the H one. I'm gonna just move down to this here. Even more. Okay. So here's the H one hello world, H two, H three, H four. This is the this is the test one, which is the anchor test. If we go to test, it won't do anything because I don't have to scroll down yet. But I'm going to move back up now. And I'm going to go back into my code. Okay. So here we have my code. And um, I don't see anything else that you might need with this. You can go all the way up to H6 which is a tiny code, a tiny script I should say, and um, yeah. Oh, just to tell you some other tags here, I'm going to go move this down, I'm going to go B, hello world, and B, and that's bold, I, guessing you can guess that, hello world, and the I there. And then U. Hello world. So I is italics. U is underline. B is bold. I'm going to save this. Let me go back over. Refresh the page. Okay, I haven't put any breaks in. So there's the um, bold. There's the italics here. Is the Okay, so there's the bold here. So the bold and the H4 are the same. There's the uh, italics and the underline, then there's the, this is a test here. So, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. I hope it helps you out. Um, keep watching my tutorials. Be sure to subscribe. And um, I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.